Hey, what's up? Uh, it's your boy, Zesty. And uh, I just kind of thought about this. Um, I was kind of laying down in bed earlier. It's like 5 in the morning. Don't worry about it. Um, but I was sitting, laying down in my bed. I was like, it must kind of suck being an artist. Like, just imagine all you do is draw things every single day. Now, I know what you're saying, but drawing things can be fun. And you're right. But, like, my sister's an artist, so I'm getting a lot of this from her. Like, she hasn't told me any of this stuff, but this is kind of the things I pick up on. So, basically, all the only presents and shit she ever gets for, like, Christmas and her birthday is an art kit. It's like arts, arts her thing. She loves drawing. She loves painting. She loves doing the whole shebang, right? But that's kind of gets stale really quick, though. Every single year, you get a paint kit, a drawing kit, whatever kit. You get a notebook. You get whatever. That's all my sister buys or gets. I've never seen her really get anything else besides those things from another person. And that's kind of ridiculous because, like, what if you want to play a game or something like New Borderlands just came out like a few days ago and what if she wants to play that she can't now because she's bought spent all of her money on art supplies there's a bunch of art shit right next to me because she uses the desk to draw it's kind of why you haven't really been around but the point is is that also a lot of your family is going to be like asking you to draw shit like I really think that's like that happens a lot in my family like you cause this artist person they're gonna be sitting there with their paintbrush they're gonna be fucking doing the thing they're like alright I'm drawing this shit and then all of a sudden their mom is just like honey can you draw this thing I got this thing I want you to draw can you please draw it for me honey like uh, this is this is a cat, you know. This is a picture of a cat somewhere. Hold on, let me, let me find it real quick, honey. Let me let me find it real quick, honey. And then it takes her all like ten seconds to look through her bag, and then she's just like, "All right, I want you to take draw a picture of this uh, thing here. It looks funny, and so I want you to draw a picture of it. It's like this is so cool. I want you to draw some of it. This is crazy." It's, it's so cool. I mean, look at it. It's a duck. Oh my god, it's a duck. It's crazy. And then the artist is just like, Alright, I'll, I'll uh, draw it for you. Um, let me get on that, okay? And then they just kind of half-ass it because they know that their parents is going to be like, they uh, draw like a really shitty picture. They're just like, alright, I'm going to draw this, 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 and this. And like five minutes later, they're done. And then they walk over to their parents and they're just like, here's this picture. I'm, I know I'm using the same object. I just don't really have any paper with me right now. But then, but then all of a sudden, the parent immediately, even though they like really half-assed this picture or whatever, they're just like, this is the greatest thing I've ever seen. Look at this pi beautiful picture. This is absolute art. I'm going to share this on Facebook. It's going to be great. I fucking love it. Is a beautiful, so fucking talented, honey. And then the artist is just like, uh, I'd rather not, but all right, all right, cool, do whatever. And then the dad shows up, and he's just all, he's happy, man. He's just like, oh, this <laughs> good job, good job, buddy. Oh, you did it. You, you made this good shit sport. Even though you're my daughter, I'm still calling you sport because that's great and trendy and cool. Like, this is just how it is with my family. Now, I'm not saying that this is a completely accurate representation, but that's kind of the vibes I get from it. And as well as that, it's just like, the artist, aka my sister, is always just like, oh god, my art, it's, ugh, it's not very good. A lot of people are, every single person I've ever shown my art to is saying, this is fantastic. But I just don't think it's that good. When it is that good. And I mean, like, a lot of people are just like, my art's trash. It's it's really bad, but it's, no, it's not. It's some good shit. 
like I, I'd show you some of the stuff my sister has drawn, but I'm afraid some of it might get me demonetized. I'm just kidding on that. I just don't want to invade her personal privacy by showing you the pictures that she hasn't given me permission to show. Anyways, <laughs> God, that sounded really inappropriate. <laughs> Um, the world's story is that artists don't really think that they're good, but my sister has won like multiple art competitions at this point, like in our hometown, and she refuses to admit that she is good at art. And I say that's freaking heresy because she is good at art. She needs to stop doubting herself because she is good. Never give up. You know that's this the. Uh, vibe and get it from you know the little uh, video where it's like that Japanese guy or Korean guy or whatever and he's just like never give up or he, what he's just like sitting in the ocean collecting sea like fucking crabs or whatever like that shit like I really feel like it's kind of a stigma with every most artists that I see they usually don't think their content is that good when in reality it usually is and it just confuses me why that happens because they clearly have a lot of talent, talent a lot of people follow them and look at all their shit like oh I'm gonna check how many followers my sister has right now so according to my phone she has about 1120 followers that's pretty good and she draws some pretty good stuff uh, it all looks like it's from Dragon Age but it's all pretty damn cool looking I gotta say but she's there's some nice sketches and she's always like Oh, these things are pretty sharp. These things are fucking fantastic. I wish I could draw like this, because then I could draw whatever the fuck I wanted. You know what I'm saying, dude? Oh my god, she even drew Pencil Skinner. And she drew the sad cat. Nervous cat. Hold on. I don't know if this is showing. It's so sad. It's so cute. She drew that. That's amazing. I'm sorry. I had Sorry, Beth, but I had to show that to uh, the public, because that's just too great. So... Anyways, that's all I gotta say, and I'm saying that being an artist must suck. Um, I think I might do more videos like this. It really just depends on how I feel about it. So, I hope you guys did enjoy it. Please, please let me know if you did. If, if you watched this video, please let me know if you actually did enjoy it, or thought it was trash and I should go back to gameplay. Let me know. See you guys in the next one. And uh, peace, peace.